might get better at it by backing up. We can back up and do that. And hit the heck out of the ball, put it in the end zone, they get them on the 20 yard line. But I know we can do better than that. We've got to back up a little bit, keep working on it. We come out early, we want to work on this phase of your punting as you warm up. Let's be real good at this stuff, fellas, because it's, it's monumentally important to us in a game. Critically important. Patient fellas, I want you to watch this. We punt the ball down the field, not really great hang time. They make a poison call. A poison call. What in the world possessed you to bat the ball, Kawaki? It's illegal to bat the ball. You can't bat the ball. How do we handle a down punt? That's exactly right. We pick it up and we hand it to the official because anything can happen. Somebody could blow a whistle and an official say, gee, we didn't blow that whistle. They pick it up and they're gone with it. This is a 43-yard punt return that sets up three points that could have been a difference in the game. Awful tackling here, guys. Just plain awful. We're not going to the whistle. We're not finishing this play. You want to make a tough commitment? I'll tell you one that you can make. I'm going to stay with the play longer than the opponent, every play. I'm going to get my ass kicked. There's no guarantees on any of this, but I'm going to stay with that play longer than the opponent. If you want to win, if you want to be a champion, you make that commitment and you keep it, and we're not doing it. We're not doing it. First of all, Kwaki, you didn't get the job done. That's give up football. We're not giving up to people like that. That's a heads up play by this guy. What are you trying to do, make this guy a champion? We're trying to play give up to these guys? Do our job. If you're ready to play, you know what to do when that ball's on the ground. When you're not ready to play, you don't know what to do. If you don't know, don't go. Don't go. And that's for everybody in the room. If you don't know, don't go. Know your job. Get ready to do your job at the highest level or you're not ready to play. That's every man. You're going to get your ass kicked right on down the line. If you're not ready, understand this league, gentlemen. Understand it. Now, there may be some people who've been around longer than me. I don't know. I've been in the league for 24 consecutive years. You don't have to take what I say for granted. I'll try to confirm it to you as we go along. But I'm trying to give you information you can use. To win, I can't guarantee it. To play the odds in your favor, the percentage is on your side. That's what I'm talking about. You're going to give up for this football team by not finishing the damn play? I'll tell you one thing, and I will help you get better. We're not probably going to go out tonight and go dancing and drinking beer and chasing the ladies, anything like that. That's not my job. My job is to get you better. You better learn how to do that. Make those tough commitments, guys. Be tough on yourself. Be tough on the practice field. Set the damn example. You, every man in this room owes every other man the impact of his demeanor. Do it. We got guys that are tough on this football team. Everybody on this football team has to be tough. I'm not going to play a snap. And I'll tell you right now, I will be tough with you. That's my job. I'm trying to give you information you need. That's awful tackle. You can't tackle, get the hell off the football team. We step to contact. We wrap. We chest them up. I told you long ago, I'm going to be consistent. I'm consistent. I told you I was going to hold you to the highest standards. I told you I was going to attack problems. I told you I was going to be extreme when I'm attacking a problem and when I'm holding you to the highest standards. That's not going to change. It's not going to change today. It's not going to change next week. It's not going to change in February. It's not going to change next year or five years from now. You say, shit, crash, you won't last that long. Don't count on it. Don't count on it. You're going to be the same. Now, you be the same. You be at your highest level all the time. Every man. Don't try to bullshit me. Don't feed me candy and tell me lies. That's not the highest level. Bullshit. Great job, Chris. Save this thing from a touchdown. Total damn embarrassment. You're not embarrassed, but you're not humiliated. And you're not a part of this deal. Now, we can overcome that. We'll go overcome defeat, disappointment, humiliation, embarrassment. We're all embarrassed. Don't feel sorry for me. I'm not going to feel sorry for you. What we're going to do is we're going to fight. No guarantees. I still don't have to. I can't guarantee you what's going to happen. I'm going to tell you, baby. You better fight.
fight your ass off. You're a professional football player at the very highest level. And I really do understand the high performance business, guys. And I understand this business, too. And I'm going to put up with it. You're not playing. There's not plenty coming out of your ass. You're going to hear from me every day. And I'll tell you, I've been trying to ease up on the field for my own health reasons. Bullshit, those days are done. I'm going to be yakking at your ass all day long. I don't care who you are. I don't care what fucking position you play either. I'm going to be after <coughs> you all day long. If I see you not hustling, not chasing that ball, not closing the gate, you're going to hear from me. And I'll run right out on the damn field and do it, too. And I mean, I don't give a shit. If I don't care, I'll piss off everybody. That doesn't bother me one bit. You want to get to the highest level, you get to the highest level with no restrictions. Don't compromise it. Don't compromise it. Don't go halfway. Bullshit. <coughs> I'm not going to have that. All right, big try again now. Uh, they got a double team on both sides. <coughs> it's a good job, Marlon. Much better. I expect you to get better. And I, I want to see it every day. You owe each, each member of this team has to see you getting better. I don't give a shit if you uh, make friends with everybody. What the hell's that have to do with it? Show people you care about being the best. That's what you have to worry about. That's all. Is there a guarantee here? None. No guarantee at all. We're just talking about how to be potentially become a champion team. We're never going to stop that. Never. Never. All right, now they're running a, uh, again, they're going to run a double run on you. And this is a very fine job in terms of our protection. You, one, I'll give you a lot of credit, guys. Every time I tell you that we have to get better, you do, go, you do that. You go out there and you get better. That's why I'm telling you what we have to have. I'm going to tell you what I have to have from you. I'm not going to mince words. I want to tell you what I have to have from you. Now, what you have to do is you have to tell your teammates what you have to have from them. You think it's easy to prepare for a game? You think it's going to be easy to prepare for Seattle bullshit? It's going to be hard. And if you think you're prepared, you're not prepared enough. Go out on the field till I have need another rep from you. Give me a better shot. Give me more effort. Give me a better picture. You afraid to say that? Then you're afraid to get ready for that play at your highest level. That's pretty good protection inside. Pretty damn good protection. Nice job of hanging it up and get it on the 20-yard line. There was a day, not, not too many weeks ago, when hell they're going through you like a dose of salt. They were, they were, they, they were damn near blocking the kicks. Uh, we, well, against Pittsburgh, we don't get them all off against them. That's changed a little bit. You guys are getting better. It's a nice job of redirecting right here, Joe. Watch your footwork right here. Against the Titans, you were floundering around on the ground a lot. You're not doing that any longer, Joe. You're getting better. And you know what? You're going to keep getting better. You know what, Kwaki? You're going to keep getting better, too. You know what else? Everybody in this room has to keep getting better. Everybody. If you think it's easy, the hell it's easy. All right, this is a good job, E.T., of stacking it up and staying in that gap, that double run. Why are they doing that to you? Because they think they can do it. They think they can whip your ass. 